Cody Shade here, product sales manager with No Boundaries, and you've asked for this video and today we're gonna show it to you. This is the 10.6 No Boundaries, okay, designed to be towed by vehicles that can't tow very much. The Nobo 10.6 only weighs 1,950 pounds, okay? Now, although it only weighs 1,950 pounds, I'm gonna show you today how you can sleep up to four people with a full kitchen, full water capacity of 30 gallons, and still have all the creature comforts at home. Now you can see we're standing on the door side of the 10.6, where you've got a full-size pantry, your complete outdoor kitchen that features a 12-volt removable refrigerator outside, uh, your two-burner cooktop, and of course, you heard me mention 30 gallons of fresh water, okay, which in a unit this size is completely unheard of. Now, with the 10.6, you do most of your camping outside anyway, so most of your time is going to be spent outside. However, we do offer a, a full 270-degree bat wing awning. Now, some of you might be familiar with what the bat wing awning is. For those of you that are not, it's built by Rhino Rack, it's got a full lifetime warranty, and it's designed specifically for an application just like this. Follow me, I wanna show you one unique feature that you're not gonna see on any other travel trailer of this size, and this is our rooftop tent. It's exclusively designed for no boundaries, and it fits perfectly on top of our 10 series floor plans, allowing you to double your sleeping capacity. Check it out. So we're hanging out inside the 10.6 No Boundaries and as you can see, super comfortable place to spend an afternoon or a few evenings. You can see we've got this set up today. Um, as the dinette package. So you get these two great flip up tables. You've got the sofa set up inside here, which you could set up on both sides, but we've got this set up so you can see how big the bed is in the 10.6. There's a lot of questions about that. And I would like to address that. Um, this 60 by 82 space is bigger than a full size queen bed. So you have a ton of sleeping space in here. Um, when the cushion package is not in the unit, you could still fit a full size ATV. Uh, full-size Yamaha, Polaris ATV, a couple of dirt bikes, uh, even a small motorcycle. You've got 55 inches of interior height that you could fit a vehicle. And again, that 82 inches of front to back space. You'll notice there's a lot of questions about the cavity in the floor. Um, Cause I have the bed down, I won't pull this up, but I do want to tell you about that. So you've got a little bit of storage underneath there. It's about nine inches deep, but this is put in place so that when both sides are in the dinette, set up, you've got a, pl a foot well to put your feet. So it just makes it a lot more comfortable when you're sitting in here dining. You can imagine this unit backed up to a creek or a lake. You've got this standard screen that goes on the back of the porch. Both doors feature um, screens as well for cross flow ventilation. This unit would come with an optional TV. Um, this one in particular doesn't have it, but all the creature comforts of a full size travel trailer we mentioned the large uh, holding tank capacity of the fresh water tank, and not to mention even a full-size air conditioner with a heat strip, a 5,500 BTU heat strip. I've personally camped in this in sub-freezing weather, under 32 degrees uh, in Flagstaff, Arizona. Never even had to turn the heater on with the insulation uh, in the 10.6. So if you're looking for a travel trailer that you can tow with a vehicle that you already own, the 10.6 is the first place you should look. 